This is Yusuke. And I'm a garlic man. Yusuke is a good friend who I met a while back in Bangkok. You may remember him from our video where we showed you how Japanese is Bangkok. A difficult for foreigners to enter. What does that mean? Uh, Fresh tomato. Out my name of the restaurant. I'm feeling I'm back to Japan. A native of Osaka, Yusuke was fed up with his corporate job back home with a boss telling him what to do. It made him depressed. I was doing the stock controlling of the some commodities, like a fashion, like e-commerce. But then he found out about affiliate marketing, so he quit his job and moved to Bangkok to work remotely. I found some like blog from the like, digital nomad, and uh, he's uh, traveling and walking, so I want to be like him. While affiliate marketing is still his main job, Yusuke has taken on a multitude of passion projects on his free time. So I found a mar uh, business chance in the local market, and I purchase an ingredient and the instrument and they start open the curry rice shop. And what happened? What happened? It's a disaster. <laughs> so the curry business failed, then what was the next job that you did? I started a daily garlic, black garlic business. And why, what was your inspiration for that? When I'm back to Japan, I found that many people start selling the black garlic. It means that Japanese people know that black garlic is a healthy food. And I start taking by myself and it's really effective. But uh, there's no so much black guy seller in Thailand, so I found this business chance. Oh man, so this must be where all the garlic is. Look at this table. So this one is a, like a, a sample I cook. What's the process like? So you buy it like this. Yeah. And then how do you make it? And put the uh, garlic in the rice cooker and keep warming 10 to 20 days. 10 to 20 days. Yeah. Okay, so let's try this one. Wow, the texture is really soft. And I won't say it's like a prune, it's like, like a dried yeah. fruit. Yeah. And it's really, it's kind of sweet and sour at the same time. This man is so clever that he even turned his garlic business into rum. Woo! Man, that is strong! I'm gonna take a bite here. That's got a kick to it, but you know what? It's not overpowering again. I can eat more and more and more. Yeah. Do you think I will get drunk if I eat all this? <laughs> okay, here we go. Whichever way you look at it, this young man is a go-getter. As a Japanese person, he is going against all odds to carve his way out to success because people from Japan traditionally work 9 to 5 jobs, but not Yusuke. My dream is to make the biggest black garlic business in Thailand. When I die, I can be happy that I did what I wanted to do in my life. I'm Drew Binsky, and if you like my travel videos, please click subscribe and join me as I plan to visit every country in the world.